Merry Christmas! <laughs>
Mm -hmm. If you were to give it me as a blind taste test, would I know that it was vegan? Probably not. I think we need to do that in the new year. We need to blind taste test um, the Greg's range. Yes. So I think if a vegan product can fool a meat eater into thinking it's meat, yeah. that is a massive tick. And that's happened quite a bit. It has. I think one of the most recent one was was it he was he was so again he was a sausage taster. Oh, yes, I remember that one. And he was so against veganism that he was blindly given a, a vegan sausage to taste and it's like oh this is really meaty this is really lovely <laughs> and was absolutely disgusted when he discovered it was vegan yeah shall we move on to the camembert camembert the camembert mm. because i mean you've seen the insides the the, the, the cheese is a very funny texture so what is in that it's Oh, it's very crumbly. Mmm. <laughs> it's almost like the insides of a veggie burger without the breadcrumbs. Cauliflower, carrot, broccoli and walnut. You know what? This is all right. Is it? I'll be honest, it looks like somebody's taken a massive dump on the plate. It, it it does look a little fecal. The the appearance is really very bad. It's the cheese is good though. But I tell you what, the taste is good. The cheese is good. I I am impressed. I'm surprised. Oh yeah. Hmm. You know what? I think I might prefer that to the one that we had last year. I mean, it's been a year, mm. but we were a bit. Over that one. This is this is really good. They just need to do something with the appearance. But I don't think don't think you really can, can you? There is only a limited number of ways you can arrange vegetables, I suppose. See so, what I mean? It gets like a skin on it. Mm. Oh, there's cranberry and everything though. Mm. And vegan cheese has obviously come on a long way. I do remem remember watching a documentary yeah. about a year ago, maybe. Maybe a little bit longer now. About the production of vegan cheese and why there essentially isn't a good one. Yeah, because they, they, you, you ask a vegan, my guess is they will, they will openly admit that no. They did ask a load of vegans, and they said, yeah, the vegan cheese offering isn't great. And they explained to you all about um, the lactose in milk and how it forms the milk structure, the cheese structure, oh. and stuff like that. It was all very technical and complicated. Well, there you go. I mean, that bit I did eat just then tasted a bit bin juicy, but that might have been the cranberry. You know what? I wouldn't be disappointed with either of those on my Christmas dinner. Oh, no, you see, I would. <laughs> or are we saying if you were vegan? Yes, if I was a vegan. Oh, right, if you were vegan, I was about to say. Um... No, I'd much prefer my leg of lamb. Oh, sorry. Right. I'd much prefer my leg of lamb. Yeah. But I think for a vegan... Yeah. It's important to have a good alternative, and I think these are. Because I think people misunderstand that it's not necessarily, you know, they don't necessarily, whilst they don't agree with the preparation of and how, you know, animals are treated in order to be made into lovely sausages, um, they still, some still miss the taste of meat. Mm. And I think, especially the, the sausage, mm, good. it's really got the taste and the texture. Mm. And I think it's great that vegans have got a good alternative. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, if I was vegan, I'd be really happy with that. Have you had any chocolate? No, I haven't. 20 seconds, Dana. 
It is the 22nd. Yep, 22nd today. And I think that's a good place to end. Yeah. It's, it's getting there. We're almost at... We should probably say that although this is a vegan video, the dad bent bar isn't vegan. No, so we couldn't commit fully to today's video. No. But um But it fits into the other twenty-three, so And we like continuity. Yeah. But yeah, I think Little and Audi do a good vegan range anyway. Mm. No, I'm very impressed with that. So there you have it. Um that's about it. Don't stick me chocolate. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye, everybody. Bye.